Well, Roast Session 2, we are back. If you don't know what's going on, where have you been? We've also been on Instagram and TikTok roasting car enthusiast accounts because I'm a car photographer. So we're roasting their pictures to help them out, give them some tips, having a bit of a laugh and learning everyone to take better photos of their car on their phone. That led to YouTube because we've got hundreds and hundreds of DMs. Again, we've got hundreds and hundreds of DMs. So we're gonna go through them a little bit more fast paced this time. Hopefully your account gets featured. If not, I'm sorry. Don't hate me, let's get started. So we're gonna go down this list, how this is gonna work is I'm gonna go onto your profile, give you an instant rating out of 10. Remember, 10 is like North Borders level, so we're like the rankings are high, and then I'll give you one thing to work on. So we're gonna start with Arthur, welcome. I just saw your roast session on YouTube, da, da, da. I know I approved myself, I discovered your profile. First person to rip my photos, well, you boy, you're here. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Let's have a look, accept Arthur Bosch, okay. Not a lot going on, but let's have a look. Front on shot, not too bad. Another front on, not too bad, a little bit out of focus. That one, we don't really know what you're shooting, bit of half and half. That's really nice. I'm a fan of that, I'm a fan of that. Get rid of the watermark though, we don't do watermarks here. Mm, bit dodgy. That one's got all right. Right, okay, I'm gonna give you a... I'll give you a five. I'll give you a five and we like that sort of shot, we like that sort of shot. Just try and not cut off half the cars like that. Make sure you decide if you're taking a full length or a side length, but a lot of these are front quarters. So try and get a bit closer to the back maybe, or to the wheels, switch it up a little bit, because all we're seeing is the front of the car, all right? But we'll give you a five. Owen Clark, let's have a look. I'll let you, you've asked me many times. <laughs> well, we're gonna, we're gonna give you a go, mate. Let's have a look. All right, we've got a nice little Lambo. Oh, this is nice. Oh, that's that place that, the Animize went to, this is, yeah, that's a nice place, this. Okay, so just nice, clean, wide shots. I'm gonna give you, from looking at this quickly, I'm gonna give you a six. We'll go for a six, um, cause they are really good shots, really, really good quality, like that's really nice and crisp. Nice little angles, you try, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna give you, like to say, go closer for something to work on, but you've actually gone closer as well there. Let's just try and switch up the feed a little bit. If you scroll down your feed, a lot of it just looks like a car spotting channel because they're like really wide shots. So try and mix in those detail shots like this, but as the first photo. So then your profile grid looks a little bit more mixed up because right now scrolling through this sort of stuff, it kind of looks like you're a car spotter that's just lifting your phone up and taking pictures. Until you actually click on them, then you see the really cool shots. So just try let's see them before because sometimes that can actually turn people off and they won't even follow you because they're like, oh, this profile grid doesn't live up to my standards. I am not following. <laughs> Mine's all over the place as well. Right, let's scroll down a bit this time. Let's go for JP. JP, roast me, brutal. All right, you said it. You said it, so let's go. Okay, not a lot of variety, so we're not gonna got, we're not got much to work with here. I like the front on shot though, and the quarter shot. Mm, that, that needs to move back, it's too close, too close. Mate, we're cutting off half a car. What we're shooting, the building or the car? That's, yeah, that's, no, yeah, you, I don't know if maybe you're trying to crop in because of Instagram, just do it in editing, like crop in and editing so then when we get to here, we're not shoving a photo into a into a square, like that's too close, mate. Because it's a really good photo, but you're just shoving it in so it just looks like shit. That one's all right, but it's just a public car park, but I guess you don't own the car, so you're just trying to car spot again. Why do you keep doing this? Why do you keep cutting off the car? You can't have took the photo like that, surely, that's just because of Instagram, but just at least move it up and down because you have the ability to move it when you when you post it. Nighttime shots, mm, not too bad there. I see what you're trying to do. We're gonna give you a, I'm gonna give you a four, mate. I'm sorry, I'm gonna give you a four just for the lack of variety. You've got some really cool stuff. So you've got potential, you just need to sort out your cropping and like you're getting some cool angles. Just move out, mate, why are you cutting off half the car? But decent stuff. Moving on, let's go to Pedro. What are you saying, mate? Can you roast me account, please, please? Yes, mate, all right, calm down, we're having a look. I've done you, I've done you before, sorry. Moving on, lay low. Right, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look. So we've got some, ooh, that's nice. Got some moving shots. I'm liking the back shot. You've got some cool uh, effects on these, like some cool edits. I'm liking the pan and shot. Yeah, you got some good stuff. I'm liking this, I'm liking this. Little detail, that's really nice. I'm a fan of that. I'm a fan of that indeed. Some nice colors here, it's cool framing. Cool framing again. I'm struggling to find something wrong with these, to be honest. You've got some really nice stuff. I'm gonna give you a solid, 
Ooh, that's really nice. I'm going to give you a 7.5, mate. Because that's some decent stuff in there. You've got some really nice colours. Really nice uh, variety. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually a really big fan of that. That's a really nice style you've got there. Yeah, that's quite cool. Maybe you could do a couple more detail shots. These are all quite wide, actually. Yeah, maybe you could do a couple more close-up details like you've done here. Bit more, bit more of that. But other than that, like, that's sick. That's a really nice quality. Really nice look and colour to the photo. Yeah, good job, mate. Can't really roast you too much on that one. We've got a good one, people. 7.5. Fair play, mate. Let's go to... Ted. What are you saying, mate? What are you saying? Uh, it's a bit of nature, a bit of cars. It's a video, not watching that. Mm, that's good. Quality. Cars. I'm going to have to give you a four. We're going to go four, mate. Um, the nature stuff's good. Like, it's sharp. I don't really know much about that, so I can't really comment on that. But for the car stuff, we're looking at, like, your standard sort of shots really really wide not much compression not much cinema feel to them that one's a bit eh, that one's all right to be fair you frame that up quite nice but yeah i'd give you a i'd give you a four it's just lacking overall dense like you see that last profile we checked out the photos were like quite dense and crisp these are quite light and overexposed almost maybe try to darken things a little bit throw some more edits on there because it's a bit overexposed and a bit just a bit light, I feel like the more, it just a bit looks a bit washed out, iPhone-ish, even though it's on a camera, do you know what I mean? It's one of them. So yeah, we'll go forward with that one, unfortunately. Sorry, still some good stuff though. Uh, moving on, moving on, moving on. Adam, let's have a look at you, mate. Mm, did you please rate my pics? Would be appreciated. I'm shooting on iPhone SE. What, I've got an iPhone, so we're not looking for too much quality here, but... Okay, no. The first one was good. The first profile picture was good. Quarter shots all round. Standard. Mm, yeah, we're going to give you a three, just because it's a, it's one of them, isn't it? You're either a car spotter or you're actually trying to be a photographer. I know he says photographer. Okay, yeah. Oh, wait, photos taken with Canon 80D, Canon 2000D. Well, you just said you're shooting an iPhone. <laughs> so what are you shooting on, mate? That's actually not too bad. Your most recent ones are getting better. A little bit overexposed. Could just do a couple more details. Shadows down a little bit. That's out of focus. But yeah, just switch up the angles. A lot of front quarter shots just makes you look like you just turned up to a meet and you're like, bosh, there you go. Lovely picture. Did I give you a rating? I'm going to give you a... I think I already gave you a rating. I can't remember. I'm going to give you a four. Either way. Um, yeah, just car spot and vibes is what I'm getting across. A lot of the profile pictures, a lot of the grid pictures, they're all just quarter shots like that. That just screams. I go to events, I like cars. There's a picture I've seen a bit. So just try to get a bit more adventurous with it. Switch it up. Zoom in a little bit, get some edits on there so they're not as washed out iPhone looking like that, all right? But overall, decent stuff, no worries, mate. Moving on. Cash, let's have a look. Can't bother to read that, sorry, but we're trying to be, we're trying to be, we're trying to be quick, mate. We're trying to be quick. Okay, not a lot of stuff here. Not a lot of stuff at all. Yeah, see what you're doing. Love the steering wheel shot. I'm, love, I'm a fan of that angle. We like that. We're going to go with a three, unfortunately, because you've not got a lot of variety. This is very much, I go to car meets, I take pictures on my phone because I think they look cool. You just need to try and get some some different angles in there. And uh, yeah, try to switch it up a little bit because it is just a bit sort of point and shoot. There you go, I'll post that to the ground. Bosh, people are going to love it. Um, so yeah, I've got plenty of tips for shooting on your phone. Go check them out. You can get some better shots in there, but no worries, mate. Good start. Let's move on to, I can't see your name, but we'll go there. Oh, I see an MX-5. Let's have a little look then, shall we? Because I see an MX-5. Okay. There's just pictures of you. Okay, stood next to cars. Right. Well, this is not much of a photog photography page, is it? To be honest. We're going to give you a two, because that's just pictures of you next to cars, mate. Sorry, we're going to move on. But I appreciate them, MX-5. Fiesta MK7 ST2 Turbo. Change your name, it's a bit crazy. You send in all the messages. Let's have a little look, shall we? Okay, 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 okay. Some Fiesta shot. Wait, did I do this? Have I done this car? I think I might have done this on TikTok. I can't remember. We're gonna give you a... I'm gonna give you a three, because it is just pictures of your car. I'll switch it up a bit, but I guess you are just a driver, maybe not a photographer. Um, oh wait, photography. 
we're going on to this, mate. Oh, is this yours? If this is yours, then... Right, okay, we'll look at this then. Mm, bit overexposed. But over, not, there's no edits on there, are there? You haven't edited them. That's... I'm not, I'm a fan of that shot. Not a fan of that. Okay. If you're shooting on a camera, which I think you are, because I can see the compression, try throwing some more adventurous edits on there. I've got a preset pack if you want to download them. Link in bio gives you some ideas and some tutorials on how to edit, but there are quite a lot overexposed. You've got some cool angles, apart from this one, um, and that one, to don't, do, don't post to the same shot. Never do that. Front on, I'm a fan of that. Yeah, you just need to edit a little bit more. You need to get some more cooler edits on there because the more washed out your photos look, the more it looks like an iPhone. And these don't really look like they've been uh, edited much. They just look a bit overexposed. The flat on shots are nice. That side on, you could move back a bit, be a bit more square. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to give you, did I rate you already? I'm going to give it a four. Either way, we'll give you a four. Just because you're nearly there. You just need to switch up the angles and edit a little bit more, mate. And that will hopefully get you some nice shots all right moving on let's have a look at someone else let's go to damien peterson what are you saying mate let's have a look let's have a look let's have a look a sony a6000 i used to have a sony a 6400 i loved that camera so let's have a look what you're doing okay not too bad that's decent a little bit out of focus on the front bumper but that's not too bad the I see where you're going with the adding the photos in, but that just looks doesn't look that great. If you're going to do it, make try and make it look a bit more. I don't know. That top right one looks quite cool. The bottom right one's cutting off half the car. I see where you're going. You've seen it on Instagram, people doing it, but just try to frame it up a little bit better. Get rid of that. I know what you're doing, but that's like 2014, making everything black and white, and then keeping the car the same colour. <laughs> Get rid of that. Again, you're doing the. Oh, okay. I see what you've done. You've done them in a carousel. Okay, well, we can't really see because you're cutting off that bit of the car. So I see what you've tried to do, but you're kind of cutting it off. But that's a cool angle of the wheel. Mm, you're cutting off the front. Yeah, it's a, I don't know. I, personally, I'm not a fan of those bits where you put the photo over the top, but not too bad. Roller. It's cutting off half the car, but it's not too bad. We'll give you a... F I'm going to have to give you a three, unfortunately. But you've got some cool stuff that you are like. That's cool. That's this location and this shoot. This is perfect. More stuff like this. Get closer. Do detail shots. Why are you all avoiding detail shots? Get some detail shots in there. It switches it up. I mean, you've got them, like the wheel shot there, but you just can't see it because it's in that little bloody thing. Get rid of that stupid thing. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Let's go to someone else. Finley, what are you saying? Can you rate my photos? No worries. Point is giving me a TikTok because I'm not going to look at it. <laughs> okay, right. We've not got a lot to work with here. Let's just have a quick look iPhone by the looks of it. Let me check. Yeah, iPhone. Okay. We're going to give you a... Th I want to go three, but I, th I guess I could... No, you've got some... Like, you're, used, you're framing the image up with some stuff. You're getting adventurous. We'll give you a three. I was going to give you a two, but you're actually trying. You can see that you're trying with these cool angles. That's what we like to see. If you're just on a phone and you're just taking, like, wide shots, there, 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 I'm going to give you, like, a two or a one because you're actually trying to get, like, close to the headlight and stuff like that. Might not be the best, but you're at least trying. So yeah, we'll give you a three. You just need to just keep practicing. Just keep getting those cool angles. Stop going low to the ground. This isn't cool. I've done a tip on this, but still stop doing it, people. It doesn't look cool. Um, unless it's on a dead straight road and it's in the middle, then do it. Other than that, don't do it. Um, yeah, you've got some cool stuff. I'm liking the fact that you're doing some close up detail stuff because the wider you go on an iPhone, the worse it looks. Um, but yeah, we'll give you a three. Watch some of my photography tips on your, on your, for your phone and yeah, just keep going. Not too bad actually, well done. Let's have a look at someone else. Who have we got, who have we got, who have we got? Alan, what are you saying, Alan? Alan, Alan. Let's have a look. What have we got, what have we got, what have we got? Okay, no. Mm. Are you on a phone or not? Or, uh, I don't say. What does it say in here? No, it doesn't say. I think you're on a phone, to be honest. We're going to give you a two, unfortunately, just because it's a bit... It's one of them. It's one of them. You're trying, but you've still got a way to go, as we all do. Um, but for now, we're going to go two. Just need to switch it up, and yeah. Yeah. That's all I have to say, really. Just keep practicing, shoot some different cars, get closer. And that'll be that. Let's move on. We're going to go to... Ooh, I see a little 
FRS there. Just need to have done with your Let's have a look, mate. Let's have a look, David Taylor. What are you saying? He'd endorse it. Little cover fight with the top. I see what you're trying to do there. I'm guessing that's you posing with your car. We're going to go with two as well, just because you're, yeah, you're on your phone. Oh, that's actually really nice there. I like the quality of that, actually. Uh, is that on your, it doesn't say if you're on a phone or not. I think you're on a phone. Um, get rid of your watermark. Get rid of that. There might be a camera. I can see a slight bit of compression in there. But yeah, you just need to get closer. Try some different angles. Go check out some of my videos. I'll give you some ideas. But yeah, it's very much... I'm a driver, I love my car, there it is, bosh, stick it on the gram, get loads of likes, job done. That's cool, that's actually, well, where, is, where are the rest of them? We want more like that, that's what you should be doing, mixed in with your other stuff, because that is sick, all right? So do some more stuff like that, please. Don't just do these wide shots. It might look cool in the moment, it doesn't look that cool. <laughs> did I give you a rating? I think I did, didn't I? Was it three or two? I can't remember, three. Sorry, two. <laughs> I, don't, I don't remember. Let's have a look. Okay. 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 I'm going to give it from initial impressions a f four. Yeah, a four, just because it's very, I'm in the street, I like cars, taking pictures once again, it's very wide, that's cool side shot, but a lot of them are just front court shots, you've seen a car in the street, you took a picture. If you want to get that more photography style in your page, you need to start switching up with some closer details, not just finding cars on the street that are already driving, find some stuff parked up like this, you could have got closer to this, but you just went for your same quarter shot that you're doing for all of these ones on the street. So it all looks the same, all right? So just switch it up. Moving on, let's go to, Fran, what are you saying, mate? Two red cars, I'm guessing you're a driver. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, I, don't want, I didn't want to do this, but I think I'm gonna to have to go for a one. No, a two, I feel bad. I feel like a one is like really, really bad. This is not bad, 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 but it is a bit bad, again. The, the idea might have been cool at your petrol station, but in reality, it's not that great. You need to, I see what you're doing there, getting closer there. We like stuff like that, getting more adventurous, but the wide shot, front shots are nice, the flat shots, we like that. Mm, not really, you're just on the side of a street. It looks like you're on a little road trip, you just wanted to let everyone know where you are. That, not very good. Yeah, you've got some work to do, but that's all part of the fun. That's good, that's not yours, is it? Or is it? because that's completely different quality to the rest of them. If they were like that, you'd get a three or a four, but they're not all like that. So where is that? Who did that? Is that your camera? Get your camera out more if that's you, because compared to this, there's a big difference, mate. <laughs> so yeah, we'll give you a two, because yeah, I feel bad. I feel like one has to be like terrible. Let's go with you, my friend. Let's have a look what we've got going on here. Right. Right, 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 right. <laughs> I, I don't know why everyone does this, but everyone goes for graffiti walls or really like grungy areas being like, yeah, that's going to be sick with a photo. Let me park the car in front of it. Bosh. <laughs> it doesn't look cool, mate. Get rid of the graffiti backgrounds. I think this is going to be have to be the one. I think you're going to have to have a one here, mate. Unfortunately, I was going to give you a two, but I just can't. They're, um, yeah, you need to do some practice, watch some YouTube videos, try some different angles out, get rid of the graffiti wall, and yeah, let's try, yeah, let's just try switch it up a bit, that's not much I can say, I think you're on a phone, there's not much you can do, depends on what phone you've got, yeah, try take some inspiration, try some things out, but unfortunately, you are the first one. Let's go, we're going to do... Two more. We're going to go two more because I don't want this video to be too long. So let's go with Oscar. Let's have a look at you, mate. What we got here? What we got? What we got? Private account. Nice one, mate. Thanks for sending your shit in. Um, next one. <laughs> let's go with Liam. What are you saying? Whoa. Let's read this one. I love, people, I love how people try to justify it, they're like, but I'm, I'm trying on an iPhone 14, you don't need to justify it, just 
Send me your account, don't worry. Right. That's what it's making my eyes do because it's so saturated and like dark and the blacks and the shadows are all the way down. You've just started editing, you're getting really excited. Just calm down. What is better for editing sometimes is going the other way and actually desaturating it, leaving the paint nice and rich, but the background to be a little bit more desaturated. Otherwise it just gets a bit too much. Like that's way too much, mate. It looks like 2014 edits, looks really amateur. Unfortunately, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to give you a two. Yeah, we're gonna go for a two because you are editing and you've got some nice little angles here. That's a cool one, I like this one. If you did some nice detail shots, like closer up, that'd be a cool little shoot there under the petrol station. And I don't mind this dark edit as much on this, but don't do it on every single one. Like, calm down. What is gonna help is just lifting it up a little bit and not going so dark. I've got preset packs with tutorials if you wanna learn a little bit more in the description. If not, just, just calm down. Stop making everything so dark and saturated. Like, what the hell is that? Just calm the fuck down. So yeah, that's your, that's your tech thing you need to work on is your editing. Stop going so dark with everything. Bring it up a little bit. Last one. Let's go for... Let's go for Josh Green. Very serious that I need to hear the truth. All right. So that's what's good about this, because you do need to hear the truth. I need to hear the truth. Well, what I'm going to tell you at the end of this is going to lead into the next video that we're going to do. Um, but you need someone to tell you what's wrong with them even if you don't agree with it, so then you can actually learn and think about it and take better photos. But this is a bit of a driver situation, like Shikar taking the photos once again. I feel like I'm repeating myself, but that is a lot of the stuff that people are taking in. We're gonna give you a two. Not a lot going on here, mate. Get a bit closer, find some different angles. That's cool. Did you take that or did you steal that from a photographer? Because that's completely different. Yeah, yeah. So just take inspiration from the person that's took that photo for you. Get some nice details in there. Get closer. Find some different angles, because you look a bit just like a driver, right? But I appreciate the MX-5. I've got one on the drive. We uh, we appreciate that. We'll do one more. I want to end on a good one. I'm going to try find a good profile picture. Logan Greenway. So look at you. Okay. Okay, we've got some quality. We've got some quality. It's a bit of the same stuff. You go to Caffeine and Machine. I'll see you there. This is cool. I'm a fan of this. I'm a fan of that. I'm a fan of that. Sort of a fan of that. I like the front on shot. Don't post it twice though. Three times, don't post it three times. Even though it's a different car, it gets boring. That's a cool shot. Okay, we're gonna give you a... We're gonna give you a 5.5. Because you've got some really nice quality on your images. You just need to switch up the angles. I'm guessing this is your car because you post it every single bloody day, but all the same shots. Front core, back core, side. Okay, we've got a side one there, detail there. The only two that I've found so far. Front, 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 three fronts to stop posting the same angle. Side, yeah, just to get closer, get some details in there and mix those with your wide shots and you'll have some really good photos there because you've got some nice quality on your camera. I don't know what, what you're shooting on, does it say? No, it doesn't say, but you've got some decent stuff there, mate. Just uh, bring some details in there as well, like this. Match that with the wide stuff and that will make, like, that's sick. I love that car, man. I want that RX-7. You've got nice front dead straight shots and back dead straight shots, but you need to mix it with stuff like this. A little bit, move back a little bit for this one, not too zoomed in, but still cool shot. So yeah, mix details in with your wide shots. That'll round your profile out nicely. 5.5, well done, mate. To close out the video, Logan Greenway. So what is gonna happen from here? Because we could do this all day. We could keep going part three, part four, part five of this roast series. It's gonna get too much, so next up, is my turn. You can roast me, I will let you do it, and we will go through the roasts, and I will take on the criticism that you people are thinking from my photos on my profile. So how to do it is you're gonna press the link in my bio to my Discord, join that Discord, and at some point, I'm gonna post in there my profile, and then I'm just gonna let the chat underneath roast me, and then I will go into that chat and record the video reacting to all the messages we've got from my profile link that I've put in the Discord, all right? So if you wanna be involved and you wanna roast my account, then join the Discord down below and I'll make that video next week and then that will conclude this roast series. But hopefully you enjoyed. If you want some edits on your presets for your iPhone or for your camera, first link in the description, along with all my gear, 
subscribe i've got other videos as well you'll probably enjoy them photography car content that is all hopefully you enjoyed people keep taking pictures and i'll see you later